you go. Is this thing on? You would, you would figure after one year of being on YouTube, I could probably start to figure it out. Well, we're figuring it out. Welcome back guys to JB's Toy Trunk. Bad gangsters of plastic, you ninjas of nostalgia, muchachos, muchachas, chicos and chicas, and everybody in between. Thanks for tuning in again to a weekly toy hunt, toy haul. And this one is probably what you would call a vlog video of what we just did up in Charlotte. That's right guys, Charlotte. They have like a hundred million comic book and toy stores up there. We wanted to celebrate the one year the right way. So Marsha and I over the past weekend said, you know what, let's go up to Charlotte, Charlotte area and see what they got. Our main focus has recently been a lot of Star Wars vintage. Not because we don't like a lot of the new and the modern, but it just grabs at you. If you guys look back a year ago to some of the uh, interviews or um, live streams that I was on, I really said I'm more modern right now. Modern's great. When you start feeling the old 70s and 80s bug, it really grabs at you, especially when you go to awesome stores uh, like we did here um, over the past weekend. Before we start these videos, just a real quick heads up. We couldn't film all of the stores that we visited and at the same time some of the stores we visited they were playing great music really enjoyed it can't play it on youtube because we'll get a copyright strike so it is a vlog type format of video there's a lot of stores that we hit up sit back enjoy and don't forget to stick around for a major vintage toy haul and at the same time a special person wants to say thank you to all of you on this channel. So, enjoy. Okay, if you can recognize the song, that is a little Willie Nelson, On the Road Again. We are on the road again. We have made it to Gastonia, North Carolina. That's right, to go poaching. Man Cave, Zach Jack Dan, Kent Pull, and whoever else is in the Charlotte area. Marsha and I are here for our anniversary video to go poach for some plastic. <laughs> uh, we need to stop to a Walmart real quick, so there it is. Uh, let's see if we could go poach some plastic. Th that's the that's the five pack. Uh, Yester Toys has this, and when it opens up, which is right here, you'll see the whole display of the um, these figures, which is the Suicide Squad, most recent Suicide Squad. I didn't think we would see this in stores. Look at this. <laughs> well, they took R two and Luke. You ready to look through these? Good. All right, some other origins. We'll jump up top. Use my go go gadget legs. <laughs> Let me know who's the go go gadget people. Loved Inspector Gadget. So, yeah, the one in the middle is graded. And that form or that Zuckus is only $9.99. Thinking about that, but you got R2 Vader. We got a stormtrooper and yes marcia asked if that's the picture or was i holding 3po in that picture and i'll post it right here that's it if i would have kept it graded this one's going for 15. <laughs> but i didn't and see that's the thing is the R rtj luke he doesn't have his robe or his lightsaber so but that's what you would put into the rancor mm -hmm. hold on Cool. You got your Ewoks. Hmm. And then look, I want this. Okay. <laughs> I want all these hot toys. I want all these hot toys. Look at it. Predator 2. Look at this. Oh, there's the Andre. I don't like it. I was thinking about grabbing it. I don't like it. Super 7. Transformers. Cool, man. There you go. There you go, LJ. They got the new malls. Oh, 
I still haven't picked up my Sergeant Creel. Is, is this where we're picking him up? Probably. We got the Vader. And I still haven't picked up my Princess Leia. This Darth Maul, though. They got, what, three of them left? What do you got? What'd you show me? Set of Phasma? Yeah? Cool. It's a trap. Oh, look at that. Just hanging here. Crazy. You don't have them? I do. I lucked out yeah. and found them in store. But man, look at that. He's going up. He's a great figure. Great vintage. It's better than some of the other ones. So I went back to go look for my Princess Leia Endor yeah. over at Walmart because they had him there for like two years. Yeah. She gone. Oh, both of them. <laughs> Shogun Optimus. Jitsu. Looks like Russell. <laughs> awesome. First time seeing Sun Man, too. Mm -hmm. Look at these. The Baker John Cena. I've seen him so many times in Walmart, and I skipped on him. I should get him. Because I have, look, I, I have, I don't have him, and I don't have the Braun Strowman. So. Have the snake, thanks to Man Cave. This is, a, I saw this one last time. The Vampire Wars. The Blade. Oh. Jeez, girl. Why do I take Marsha on all these hunts? Because she's the one that said, let's go to Charlotte. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, every time we come here, I keep looking at that. I'm going to grab him one day. Mumra. MK for our Jersey Geek. Got a little chips for me. Who we got in there? Some cops, some Rambo. I don't see Rambo himself. But Walking Dead. And got some turtles over here. Foo Fighters. Mm -hmm. So this Dusty I've had on pre-order with GameStop because I got them at $18. And I've been waiting on them for about two two months now. Need some Dusty. Who else? Who else is this? Oh, and then, hey, and Zorana. What's weird? What's weird for those of you guys? I mean... That they have it? No, but that's weird. Oh, yeah. That's a big complaint that a lot of us have is the, uh, a lot of the art. Pick one or two artists and keep it consistent. You know? Keep it consistent. There's a, an original Sky Striker, not Air Striker, like I was calling it on the live stream. Yeah, Marcia said, do you see these swap things? Of course we did. I oh, see a reflection. <laughs> But yeah, um, Skin Man, Swamp Thing, Anton, the actual Snap Up Swamp Man, and then who is this one? Tomahawk. Now, th these Caspers are pretty awesome, pretty sick. Fat, so I'm getting that. Look at this right there. That's too cool. Yeah. Babe, I'm getting this. <laughs> his name is Fatso. Oh yeah, that's Fatso. Look at that. That just looks too cool. What are you gonna do with it? Put him on the peg wall. Oh look, here's a uh, Bart's buddy. What's his name? <laughs> oh, 
What else we got here? Stinky. Stretch. The actual Casper. Nuh uh. We're Century at. Century, we have Robocop. Not only do we have Congo, we have Robocop. Where? Oh, yeah. Man, these are. They're so cool. I'd buy that for a dollar. Some select Ghostbusters. Oh, they have it. The Grim Sword just hiding. <laughs> Hold it. <laughs> oh, he's heavy. I know. Oh, beefy. Let's see if I get a wish. First time seeing. There you go. Beefy. That could be your weird thing from your collection. Yeah. <laughs> Awesome. Attacking the dragon. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh yeah, these are Drexel. He's like, oh yeah. Look at you go. <laughs> Look at you go. All right, guys. Hey, that was uh, Marcia talking about that score she got at uh, Gaston Pickers. We were at Gaston Pickers. And before that, we were at Gamers. Uh, hanging out just here in Gastonia. So just in about two and a half hours, we've already hit a couple stores. Uh, antiquing, looking for collectibles. Saw awesome stuff there as far as uh, retro toys. You know, you know, not the best condition, but hey, good deal. They're always willing to work with you. Good times. So, gamers, Gaston Pickers. It's lunchtime, but we haven't seen our buddy Jimmy at Back in Time Collectibles in quite a while. We went, but he wasn't there one time. Hopefully, he's here today. Uh, we're just gonna go say hi, see what they got, and um, definitely uh, try to get some footage in there. After that, grab some lunch, and then yes, try to head up to Cherryville um, to go see Cotton, Retro Toys and Collectibles, backtrack to see Tracy and the guys over at Needless, and that should be it for toy hunting today. We're gonna just do it all, poaching. Perfect. There you go. That's awesome. Little Robbie the robot. All right, guys, we made it to back in time right here in Gastonia. As soon as you walk in, you got your wrestling, your wrestling. That's how Man Cave says it. Got your Lucy's right here. That's for our buddy Jersey. Just going to do a quick walkthrough, guys. Definitely hit these guys up. Especially if you're in the area. Now, let's go look at this turtle wall. My goodness. Most of them are complete. And if they're missing something, it might be like one or two things. But right up front. you would be here for days. Did he, did he get this from one collector or was it just he pieced um, it together? Yeah, actually, it came from... One place, most of the vintage turtles did. Wow. And while you're looking at the vintage turtles, don't forget about the vintage turtle layer that's right up here on the yeah on the detail. <laughs> All right. Was uh, what's missing or was it just the elevator or the only thing that's missing is the handle for the lift. The lift yeah. will still work. Right. It's that's all that's missing. So it's 99% complete, down to the little spike bomb that everybody lost. Which which is 99% of what everybody. Yeah. Either misses or breaks. <laughs> right. That's awesome, man. And then that crane uh, in the background there is from a uh, a place called Print 3D in Cherville. Jace. Jace. That's oh, yeah. Right. Yeah. And that's just a blown up version of the original crane figure. Power Rangers, Motu, some Motu Origins. Don't forget your newer Masterverse. Fakers, that's kind of hard to find. Let's go look through WWE. Got these guys. Cena. Austin. Hot Rod. Thundercats. 
a wino. Here's your mumra. Mumra, mumra. Don't forget Ghostbusters. Got loose. Got loose. Motu, new and old. And then, of course, right over here, you got your Joes. Classified Joes. Some loose classified Joes. That's interesting. Don't see that too often. Who else do we got back here? Lady J. Trooper right there. That's the officer, right? Yeah. Wall of Star Wars. Black Series and a Vintage Collection. <laughs> He's looking for Annie. Mm -hmm. Watu's looking for Annie. Oh, here's a chase. Oh, look. These are that. He's looking for Annie. Mm -hmm. Yep, here. And then the old 3PO from episode one. <laughs> this is a good one here, the 212 Trooper. There you go. Hang out with uh, Princess mm -hmm. Leia. Yeah. There you go. She's right here. <laughs> See? Oh, I like his, um, his sock goods. <laughs> He's ready for the disco. Yeah. Ah, uh, nah. Yeah. I mean, not. No. You gotta focus. Focus. OT. 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 Leia. Who else do we got here? Some Ahsoka. Yeah, these troopers are really awesome. I like those. Some credit collection back there. Fennec Shan. Some older black series. Here's that Phasma I still don't have. Oh, that's the damaged one. Huh. That's interesting. What, what I don't remember that? seeing that one. Of... Transformers over here. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Megatron in his tank. Oh, there you go, Mr. Sintastic. Oh, there you go, LJ. <laughs> that Thundercracker. Yeah. Coronation Starscream. Got the crown. What else we got? Fortress Maximus. Loaded up, guys. Got some loose right here in the case. This is this is what this is what you get for Valentine's Day. Oh. <laughs> oh look. Hey, look. Sylvester, is that Sylvester in? That's oh, a different pose for Sylvester. Wiley e. Coyote, Porky Pig. There's Bugs. And Elmer Fudd. Elmer Didn't see a Tweety. Oh, there's, um, what's his name? Oh, there's, yep. Roadrunner. Um, the Roadrunner. And then Yosemite. So everybody but Tweety. Man. Sorry, Mom. We'll look for Tweety. <laughs> look at that, buddy. That's nice. Some more Zelda. Some Street Fighter. We have those. Mortal Kombat. Some loose figures. And then some marble. New and recent marble. Got some marble select up there. You're gonna help me dig through this? Oh, what do you need out of it? I need one of everything. I'm just kidding. Here's that ghost rider. Love that ghost rider. Hobgob. Wolverine. Black Widow. So with the new Ant Man, which we haven't seen yet, look at that. It's the one we never picked up. But I like that Plays just Dragon as much. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Look 
like a toaster on wheels. We'll look at Bumblebee. <laughs> Gotta look at the bed. Mm -hmm. Little Top Gun Maverick. Mm -hmm. Feel the need for speed. <laughs> Air Striker, Sky Striker, Transformer. So check this out. All right, Jersey, if you're looking for a chase. Billy Graham, oh, Superstar Billy Graham. And who's that back there? Mysterio. And Captain Lou. Alright, so back in time is over there. Just up the road in downtown Gastonia. West Main Ave. Whiskars. Oh, it's a lounge. Oh, whiskey and cigars. Durr. <laughs> okay. All right, let's go try this. I find the invisible man. Open that up for me. Careful. That's the must. Thank you. And what else did you find? Dracula. No way. I don't think so. Oh, I think so. I say you're lying. Mm -hmm. It's crazy. Oh, they also have the Grim Sword, which we've seen. Sonic Gamers. The Grim Sword. Oh, yeah. And then the Big Predator, we've, we've seen before. We found this at a Target. This the stone one. Oh, Chrissy Moltisanti. Baker. <laughs> yeah. So you found these. It's off to see the wizard. Mm -hmm. That's a big Dorothy. <laughs> That's a big Toto. Oh, I didn't know they were doing this. What the? Oh my God, I got that t-shirt. I'm not wearing it today. It's awesome. All right. Oh, um, <laughs> not going to stick a banana in the tailpipe. That's awesome. Look at that mustache. <laughs> That's mustache of the year right there. Since we're here. Giant. Oh, Jay and Simon. Oh, where? Jay Muse, congratulations. Mm -hmm. Family man. Daddy, daddy. There's your mummy. Where? Oh, look, oh, Prince Akeem. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Pretty soon he'll be washing lettuce. Awesome. Oh, Spicoli. There's a lot. Want that. What else? What else do we need? That one of everything? <laughs> <laughs> Vintage collection. Oh, yeah. Here's a 
Got to wait. See, I don't have him. <laughs> Sign Razor Ramon. I'm going to suppress them. Ooh, Macho. Great it. Who we got right there? Anvil. And I'm going to sit over here. Nolan Sentry. Here we go, guys. The Krampus. What was that? Yeah, I just got him the other uh, two days ago. Furious 4. It's kind of hard to see. Furious 4. Awesome set. Let's get you in there. Yeah, I know this is what I saw on the saw on his uh he has this on his website. And that's that's another thing too, guys. If you're not in the area, go to the website. Uh, if you see anything you like, hit up Tracy. Put the link and contact information down below. And yes, I got mine from my wife. But you can get yours from Tracy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sentinel. Could we use two more of those? No? Look at that four. I know. Beefcake. Mm -hmm. Is that that's not Hemsworth, is it? <laughs> Do what now? <clears throat> yeah, we got him. We're good. We got him. We got him in the five pack that that just dropped. Oh, that's right. So there you go, Big Hulk, Spider Man, Thor, Deadpool. Got some classified over here. That's the uh, three pack. Viper, three pack. Oh. Yeah. And the only one out of that I don't I have. Show me, turn around. Let me see that. There you go. Yeah. Should have got it, but I didn't. But you already had him. I, n not this version. I have the, um, the undercover version where he's wearing the, the trooper outfit. But yeah, look at little Bill Burr. Bill Burr. So we got Migs. They're all Migs. Oh, here's the new Grogu. Look at that. You know who's looking for this? Ron. Ron. I don't. I'm out. Um, okay. Pretty easy to find on Facebook, though. Okay. All right. Just oh, or Man, that's awesome. Okay. So we got Rattlor. Is this, is this the whole wave? So Rattler, Cobra Khan, Boltman, and Snake Armor, He-Man. There's Whiplash. We still haven't picked up. Should we pick him up? Oh, there's the new Roboto. Yeah. King Randor, I need. Do you don't have a King Randor? Back in today. Roboto. Those are all Robotos. Yep. Troopers, Boltman, ooh, Hypno. Baby, can you get me out here? We got the 89 Batman order deluxe version. Look at that, Hypno. Oh, I thought you said Spider-Man. Oh, man, pulling out. And then put that Boltman back in. I saw that one. Oh, cool. And then we got Snake Armor Skeletor. These are older ones. Okay. And then the 40th he man. That's awesome. No Randor, though. King Randor. There's Di Digitino.
Shadow Weaver in too? No, I never got that one. Look at this, bro. Was that one an exclusive? I don't know. I've seen people with her, with her reviewing her. I don't know where she's. But I haven't seen her. Is she's exclusive? I don't know. I don't think you had it. Was like showing up on the Amazon the other day, in and out of stock at some places. Oh, man, new faces. Yeah, new faces. You got the new bishop. Yeah. Ooh, there's the crow. I, I the Babe, here's the crow. Yeah. So, here you go, guys. Looking for the some of the new Mesco talk with Tracy. Um, remember, if you're looking for it, give him a call. Contact him. If you don't have it, you can find it and or put you in the right direction. So, definitely. Look at that, Charles. First time we lived that way, I lived in Goose Creek. I was a kid. I was a baby. I still remember because I did go, I went to kindergarten. Look at this guy right here. Part of second grade there. We moved to Bath, Maine. Here you go, quarter scale predator. Jeez. I enjoyed it the second time because the place we had. As soon as you come in, if you don't look, you're gonna miss it. Hollywood Hogan, Dusty Rhodes, Macho, with the Mean Gene head. I should just put him on. Uh, I should put him on John Favreau's suit. <laughs> this is the new wave. That is. Yep. Oh wow. Dusty Rhodes. Oh, Macho, Hollywood, and all we're missing is, can you hold that for a sec? Yeah. Look at those pants. There's Macho, Dusty Dusty, all we're missing is, oh, is uh, rock. The Rock. But <laughs> but that's that's the build a figure I want to yeah. build right there. Mean Gene Okerlund. Look at that. Where are you taking me? You know, back to gamers. Um, where are we going? Oh, gamers, L. Okay, day two, we have a few hours before we hit up another store. So yeah, we're going back to gamers. Look at these. Look at these. Rod drill. Oh, he's a drill. <laughs> It's almost like GoBots. Machine Robo series. Mixer Robot, Mixer Robo, Shuttle. I know, there's so much, I know. There's so much, ooh, this guy. I'm looking for a tough trailer. Not just any trailer, a tough trailer. This right here, how many of you guys picked this up? The G.I. Joe Transformer collab. All Striker with Bumblebee. I like that collab.
Samurai Wars spawn. He is beefy. He looks like a Gamorrean guard. Gamorrean guard, Ninja Turtle. <laughs> Definitely. Awesome. Oh, look at the. I didn't even see that. The skulls in his oh, chest. Yeah. Look at the detail. It's the souls. The lost souls. Is that from um, Pirates of the Caribbean? 1,000 souls. Little shrunken head action. Well, that's pretty cool. Th this would look good on any shelf. Yeah. He's got like a minotaur. He's got he's got hooves. Hooves. Three headed dragon, not a two headed, but a three headed. Now this, I could do that. That's actually really cool. <laughs> right. Box is actually pretty good shape too. But you gotta bust this guy out. Is that like the SOS pad? <laughs> <laughs> you got the SOS pad going on. I like it. So when you are come to the Charlotte area, never forget to stop by Red Genesis. And the next few minutes you're gonna see why. I'm gonna say nothing's changed because it's all awesome in here. If you want awesome, if you want nostalgia, if you want that retro, if you want that vintage Star Wars, which I'm looking at, yeah, yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. So we're just gonna. Yeah, if you want to sell your stuff, you know where to bring. <laughs> That's right. If you need to sell, if you need cash. Cash. On a Sunday. And you're doing trades too, right? Yeah, oh yeah. Yep. And he's open on Sundays. Let me be your bank. <laughs> You guys got to hit him up. It's looking good, man. You, it's looking really good. So we've been looking at vintage Kenner and not only does Red have good TMNT and you know anything vintage but of course his star wars counter collection is always good we're probably going to look at some droids as well as where did i see it there's some r2s i mean i need to upgrade my r2 maybe some ewoks we're definitely going to look at that jawa we got some Thundercats up here. Goes right into the Motu. Some more Motu, vintage Motu. All the way down here, guys. Swing back around. We're gonna hit some of, some of these detox and these awesome displays. TMNT, some Voltron, <laughs> even for the Dukes of Hazard fans. Oh yeah. So in this case, we got some Transformers now, before it used to be TMNT, but this looks good. I guess you gotta have to do it with your vintage Transformers. Look at that. Look at that right there. You don't see that too often. Looks pretty good condition. And look at that Megatron gun. Is that new, that Megatron gun? No, I've actually had it for a while. I just, when I got that loaded the other day, I paired it up with it. Yeah. So I just got everything in one case. Now. Right. It looks good, man. Yeah. Thank you, man. That's a, that's a tough find right there. It is. Let's go ahead and start sweeping the store over here. We got Talon Five Point Dread. We got some Motu new and some some older. We got your party wagon over there. Let's see what else we got. There you go. There you go, Sentry. Pizza points. Get your pizza points. 
great condition. He's got back there. Oh, you can be here for days, guys. Be here for days. Who's that, Eddie Guerrero? I need that. Not that one. <laughs> I'm going to go fix my sign and make yourselves at home, guys. All right, brother. Thank you. <laughs> Where? Oh, yeah, the Godzilla. Those are so cool. Those will look so good with our other Godzilla. I mean, they're like 100 times better than the reaction figures we got. Look at that. That is just so awesome. Here's a spawn. Some Saigor. Here's a blade. You've been seeing blade out, but this one's actually in box. With the different head sculpt. We got Red Hulk. Who do we got hiding back there? We've got your Wolverine. Is that the Wolverine Hulk two pack? Yep, Wolverine Hulk two pack. This is a good. This is a good two pack right there. Got your Universal Monsters. Don't forget <laughs> my pet monster. Core scale mm -hmm. foot soldier. Got some pops. Got the pop wall. Got Prince Adam. Flocked. I didn't know there was a flocked He Man. <laughs> <laughs> you need your He Man flocked. Oh man, look at this. Look at this. Look at this display of horror. My gosh. Head on a chopping block. What do you think? Pretty cool, huh? Did you get the biker mice? Did I get my what? Your biker mice. <laughs> <laughs> no, did you get your hassle, huh? <laughs> Star Lord's dad. <laughs> Amigo, and then of course, some more down there. It looks great. Some black series. A lot of them we already have, right? Mm -hmm. That's true. Some good ones, though. Yeah. These are starting to become harder, harder and harder to find from the clones. This is a hard one to find sometimes. Look at that. That's actually not bad. It's not bad at all. EC09? Huh. I think I see something. I do, I do. Oh, man. I know. We've been wanting this for so long. And it's got, well, it's obviously inbox. The card's not bad, but might have to think about this because we need a good R2 with our setup. My chicken nuggets. <laughs> what is that? that Bateman again. That's two Batemans we've seen. Ghostbusters. Got some loose, loose vintage over here. And of course, you got, if you're a gamer, you got to come get your Nintendo. Some silver hawks right at the top. Was that smash right there? Axe and smash? Yeah, you can walk back there. No, I'm good. I could get it right here. Okay. Man, in box. 
<laughs> Dude. Yeah, man. What? That's crazy, dude. Yeah, that's the hardest one to find, too. Complete? Yeah, the only thing about it is the seat on it is a repro. Okay. But everything else there is original and it's complete and it comes with the driver. Right. And that's this one's the hard one to find. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's the late wave stuff. Yeah. Wow. But you know, your boy, he got all, he got a lot of my good stuff. And <laughs> I have sold a, quite a few other pieces of that stuff too. So that's pretty much what I've got left. All right. Oh, was I this from there. the same guy? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah, same collection. And that's the one that came in with the, ha that came with the Hasbro Pulse with the skiff. Oh, okay. So okay. yeah, he's just been separated from the skiff. But he's still. Not the original. But still, man. Yeah, he's still hard to get and, and he's really desirable. Good card and everything. Yeah, nice card. This Predator bust. Yeah. <laughs> So, from what I can tell, I think that is a movie theater prop. And okay. I have the hands back here as well. Uh huh. So, my guess is it's officially licensed by the studio. Right. So, my guess is that would have been at like an LA, New York, Chicago theater when Predator 2 came out. Gotcha. So, if you guys didn't know, outside of Red Genesis, he's got his nice little digital uh, frame. And look at that. That is the daddy himself permanently ingrained in the uh i guess the lore of red genesis right here in gastonia so yeah um good time here red genesis with red hanging out and uh, i think this changes too so i think it's on a loop but um oh yep there you go so yeah here we are guys it's a sunday day two in gastonia we got one more store to go to but before we go to that other store, one more time. Red Genesis, vintage toys, video games, consoles, buy, sell, trade. There's the number. So I couldn't film in the store. But Nolan, if the lady who helped me out was right, her name was Sarah. We got three going to Chi-Town. You got to let me know, man. <laughs> Guys, welcome back to the what's in the trunk portion of today's video. If you like the video so far, go ahead and hit that like button. Make sure you're putting those comments down. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button so you can see what else we could do with JB's Toy Trunk. Without further ado, let's get right into, that's right, Vintage Star Wars Hall. Let me introduce officially on the channel, Huntress or the Hunt Commander. That's right, AKA Marsha, my house commander. Come on up, she's got her first, the first two halls with us right here. So before we go, this to my left is Marsha, my beautiful wife. Hey guys. Anything to say? Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> so few words, but they mean so much. So thank you. So this right here is FX7. This was one of my favorite Kenner Star Wars toys as a kid. I would play uh, a lot with the arms. They are workable and working. So I had to pick him up. And there's only certain uh, Kenner Star Wars that we're picking up. Um, Yes, um, a lot of the bounty hunters, robots, droids, and uh, it, basically the evil aliens. You need that in your, you need that in your collection, evil aliens. Absolutely. Okay, just like me. Okay, so I love this guy, and Marcia said you got to get this guy right here. Um, Reyes, I think that's how you say his name. Uh, with weapon, some of the figures that I got didn't have weapons. You'll see here in a second, but this guy had the weapon. Who doesn't need him in your collection? Just a couple miles up the road from Gamers Alley is another great toy and collectible store owned by Jimmy. So where do we get him at? Oh, back in time. Back in time collectibles right there in Gastonia. Down the street from the Italian restaurant, which we kind of put that. <laughs> I can't even mangi on mamo, something like that. The food tasted amazing. So if you're in Gastonia, check it out. You found this guy. I did. That's right. She found the Klaatu in the back in the loose section. And we've seen a couple of him before at other places. But um, this this particular one, I think there's three specific ones. This one right here, I, I'm going to say this is the thick loincloth. They have a thin one and they have one, I think, with more of a tan um, type of look to him. So uh, the Klaatu right here with weapon, um, great pickup. And again, these figures that we picked up, they're not the mint on card. How much was that 3PO we found? Oh, I think it's like 1700 1700 yeah, Anyways, 
we are going for great looking figures at a good value, meaning they're playable. If someone picks it up and messes with it, we're not going to get mad at them. We, we can't, we can't go graded right now, unless you let me. Oh, I could. <laughs> she could, but you know, right now we're Top not. Top ramen. Top ramen, baby. <laughs> After lunch, we went up to Cherryville. So we finally connected back with Cotton, our boy Cotton. And he has previously hooked us up with, do you remember? What did we get from Cotton last time? Oh, we got a man cave. <laughs> what do you mean a man cave? <laughs> what do you mean a man cave? Oh, man cave's beard. We picked up the two Banthas, which Bantas. are like man caves. Actually, we picked up one from there and one from Gamers. But yeah, we got, um, and the Rancor. And the Rancor? Yes. And the band. And the band. That's right. So... <laughs> We've picked up some vintage uh, Kenner Star Wars from our boy Cotton many times over. So uh, it just makes sense if we're on a Star Wars vintage hunt, we had to make sure that we ran into him. Uh, right off the bat, I've been trying to track down, you remember his, this guy's name? Squid Face. Squid Face, Squid Head, something Squidhead. like Squid Head. It is like Squid Head, Squid Face, Squid Head. He reminds me of, um, was it uh, from Pirates of the Caribbean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, and I think his name is like Tessic or anything like that. Now, great we've seen what we saw one in gaston pickers we did but, but but his um his cloak was all dirty okay his cloak was dirty it was kind of it was soiled yeah. we don't want a soiled squid head also at retro toys and collectibles we picked up we with weapon and this guy's pretty good condition we saw a couple with um they had a lot of marks around the f the, the feet um some paint issues up here Again, great deal, great value. Um, I don't see nothing wrong with this figure. If you were to walk up to him, obviously he's not like super mint, but at the same time, I think this this guy would be a great um, addition to anybody's uh, vintage Star Wars collection. So, Weequay, my number one dude that I, I don't know. Return, yeah. of, Return of the Jedi. I don't know what the connection is with this guy. He's just kind of funny to me uh him and general lando which again figure of the year because he's still on the pegs <laughs> lando, lando 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 we'll just go ahead and put a lando right here but nib nib nub we can never say his name right nib nub uh him or he and general lando piloted the millennium falcon to take out the death star again so no weapon, but again, I, I'm okay with him not having a weapon. I'm sure I could find it somewhere. So that was the three from Retro Toys and Collectibles. Day two. Day two. Who did we see? Red from oh. Red Genesis. Red from Red Genesis. Day two, you saw there, we were hanging out with Red. And yeah, we found even more vintage Star Wars. So that's why we want to continue the Star Wars Star Wars pickups. First one I want to bring up is, well, I think it's 21B, the medical droid. If you guys remember from Star Wars when Luke lost his hand, this was the guy helping uh, recover him in that the tank. Um, you know, the tank of special juice. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Mm -hmm. So I had I had him as a kid and I needed to get him. And he does come with his poker. So uh, thanks, Red. Great deal on this one. Another one was, you guys all remember this guy, I'm sure, the gonk droid. Now, we did have a good discussion. He had three of these there. Um, some were Hong Kong, some were Taiwan, some were a little bit, um, you know, different prices, uh, different conditions. But this one was the one that suited us and fit us the best. And you could hear it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a little brown. It sounds rusty, but I mean, it just brings back nostalgic uh, feel and sound, you know, when you hear that. So got the gonk droid. What else did we get? R5D4. You need an R5-D4 in your vintage Kenner set. What do we got? Jawa. <laughs> and he's missing. The gun. And where did I leave it? But where is it at? At Red's. It's at Red's. So when we had left, we put him in the bag. Red called me up probably about 10 miles away from the shop. We were headed into, uh, into town. And yeah, I left his gun at his store. So he was complete. This is complete with the cloth robe. Not the vinyl robe. The vinyl robe was what? I mean, he didn't have one in a vinyl robe. Vinyl robe goes up there, hundreds of dollars. So it was good to find a Jawa, great price with the gun. A little bit of, of scuffing right around the hands and actually not too much scuffing around the feet, which is, which is normally where you would see it. So here we go. We got our first of, I don't know, I'm hoping another one or two more Jawas to add to the collection. And we have been looking for a good 
40th anniversary Star Wars R2-D2 on card, but I'm probably going to take them off card. <laughs> womp womp. Womp womp. But um, we've been looking for this guy for a while and Red had him in the store, so we had to pick him up. Needless, Toys and Collectibles in Lincolnton. That's right, the Bella Lugosi Dracula with color. And I don't know. He's just... You said we're getting them. Oh, yes. yeah. We we were gonna kind of hold off because of our we were trying to be disciplined and staying with the Star Wars uh, vintage. But guys, if you are in the Universal Monsters, this is a must. Um, Frankenstein is great. Wolfman's pretty good. Uh, we saw the Invisible Man. Yeah, the Invisible Man. We we laid off on him, but we definitely wanted to pick up Dracula. We'll get the Invisible Man probably when we see him again, and then one more is coming out. Was it? Um, Who's coming? Is it Bride? Yes. Yeah, that's right. It is the Bride. Very good. My Bride said the Bride. So there you go. You're just hanging out? I'm just hanging out. All right. So guys, one year on YouTube, JB's Toy Trunk. Thank you so much for everything. Thank you for the support that you're giving us and of course our family on, on these hunts. It's our journey. Um, it started off with, what did we start off collecting? Hot Wheels. What kind of Hot Wheels? Character Hot Wheels. Character cars, character yeah. Hot Wheels, and uh, we still look at them. Uh, Marsha, if she's out, she'll see it and she'll she'll say, "Hey, uh, what do you think about this?" And it's like, "Yeah, it looks great," but you know, we I think we found a new love with action figures. So, what do you guys think? Do you think we uh, do you think we had the uh, action figure toy hunting itch after a whole year of this? <laughs> Um, I don't know what else to say. I know this is a lengthy video, guys, but uh, again, we wanted to make sure that we put that vlog out there of our our experiences. Um, this video is pretty much, it, it, it captures anything and everything that we've done throughout the whole year. Um, the laughs, the fun, meeting a great community. And I think this is where I want to leave it with Tracy, Cotton, and Red. And we did go to Rebel Base. Uh, they had some great stuff. We didn't pick up anything there, but the team at Rebel Base and the team at Game, uh, Gamers Alley. Meeting our guys, um, Man Cave. <laughs> Man Cave, Zach, Jack, Dan. Um, those guys have quickly become part of our family. Um, and of course the extended family because we don't see them as often, but you know, Uncle Oleg, Mr. <laughs> Sintas <laughs> Mr. Sintastic, uh, the Jersey Geek, uh, he and his wife. And then of course, our buddy, Century the Mad Collector, the daddy himself. The daddy himself. The daddy himself. By the time you guys see this, he's probably, uh, he's a couple days away from getting married. So congrats, Ron, if you were to even watch this video because you're such a busy dude. But congratulations to you on your uh, your soon-to-be nuptials and um, everybody in the community. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what else to say except thank you. Yeah, th thank you, mm, and thank you. yeah, mm -hmm. thank you. It's um, it's really amazing uh, where we were at just a couple years, and where we're at now because of the community, and uh, it just means the world. You enjoying it? Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, are you going to get your own channel? No. <laughs> <laughs> and that is Marsha right here, uh, gents. I know we talk about it a lot on the side. She is not getting her own channel, even though she should, because she finds she's a sniper. That's mm -hmm. what I was going to say. She is the toy hunting sniper. Um, she'll see something a mile away and grab it. So um, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you guys for everything. Make sure that you find the um, the positivity and the enjoyment out of the collecting world whether it's vintage new modern you know whatever line that you collect with you if you have children your grandchildren even um it's it's what it's all about you know the nostalgic feel and having fun with it enjoying the ride in life guys that's kind of like what we just want to do enjoy the ride in life see you guys next time Peace.